the um you know you're, yeah i mean yeah. sorry uh the, the, the rea that's the reality fast money comes with slow problems and one of those is that if you decide to go into certain professions you might not deserve a certain caliber of guy that's just what it is it's tough out here maybe y'all just talking to girls y'all don't like are you single what do you mean? Am I single? Yeah. That's an interesting question that you <laughs> asked. Answer, answer. Are you That's single? Because we're both single, so it's like, does a profession no, but matter? It's different. We're but men. Hold on, hold on. Is a single man the same as a single woman? Is we're both single. No. Okay, let me ask you this. She's lost. Uh, <laughs> do you control who fucks? Yeah, right? Like, a guy can't have sex with you unless you like him, right? And you tell him, yeah, we well, can Well, yeah, fuck my body, my choice. Whoa. Fantastic. Whoa. If it was the other oh, way around, what okay. is it then? No, no, no. You're right. It is your body, your choice. Guess what? My ring, my choice. I pick who gets a relationship. Ah. Oh. Me too. No, you don't. No, you my don't. own life. I Men pick you. you, right? Right? You. D Men are the ones that give relationships and security. Women are the ones that give sex. So, for you to sit there and say, oh, are you in a relationship? That's like me asking, do you fuck guys? You can fuck any guy that you want. Well, I could commit I, to any girl I that I want. I just ask if you had a girlfriend. Simple question. It's not the, it's not the correct question to ask because we yeah. give different commodities. Mm -hmm. We're not the What same. you should be asking is, can you fuck girls? Uh, and then I'd be like, oh, yeah, maybe. But that's like me asking you, do you fuck guys? You'd be like, well, I can because it's what I give out. That You can't try to ask me about something that I give out. I give out the relationships. You, you're selective on who you fuck, right? Yeah, so are you. No, I'm selective on who I give a relationship to. Very That's the difference. So I'm women confused. are not selective on who I But to answer your question, I just asked to you answer your question, I do have honest. a girlfriend. Yes, okay. to answer your question, I do. Okay. But it's an open relationship. I can do what I want. See? And she's Good close on her end. Misogyny. Yeah, so you, I see what you tried to do there. Because this, th this is what women do. Yeah. Shame. You'll, you'll prove them wrong. And then they'll try wait, to shame wait, you. Do you have a girlfriend? Wait, can I ask you? Yes, I do. Why is she closed and why are you open? Like, because I'm a man. What? But why can't she? It's their open. arrangement, so they can Besides, do what they want to yeah. do. You don't have to do that. They they can do it if they're I happy. Think Let that's them do just it. what Leave people it do. No, no, because in general. because open relationships with women never work. Like your yeah. girl can't go out there and fuck other people. It doesn't work. <clears throat> Prime example. See, I fuck other girls, and I appreciate my girl even more. Yeah. <laughs> but if you fuck other guys, you're gonna go ahead and probably lose attachment to your guy. Men and women are not the same. New point there. There you go. Let me know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, can I ask y'all a question? Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead, Jack. So, look, ladies, if there's a guy, right, and he's like a player, he's community dick or whatever y'all call it, do you think he deserves a good, loyal woman? No. You? No. Do you think he deserves a good, loyal woman who's going to stay faithful and look nah, after him and all gonna, that? Well, listen, no, he's no. not going to be loyal to her. Mm. Huh? He's not going to be loyal to her. So what no. about you? Yeah, because she can change him. Oh no. no! Oh no! Oh no! We we gotta be better than that. No, what about you? Yeah, I'm trolling. I'm it, it depends on their dynamic. Like if if like in your situation, your girl knows what you do and she accepts that. Like I think that that's your guys' relationship. That's your. But you choice. think a guy? Let's say if I was a guy, not not yeah, where I have an arrangement say. where it did, not where I have an arrangement where it's like okay, we're gonna do this. She agree, but if I'm a guy, yep. slinging wood all in the community and whatever, playing and playing on women. Do I deserve a good loyal woman? I'm just want to know. No. No. I feel no, like no. everybody deserves that, but at the same time, if you out here just giving it up, you can't expect somebody to be just willing to give it up like that. What about you? The same. No. What about no. you? Not off backs, right? Damn. What? What about you? I said no. No. Oh, so let me ask you. <laughs> Does a sex worker? I knew he was going with. I this. already knew that. I already I knew, knew that. that. I already I knew that. Like, go ahead, finish. <laughs> Because they asked me this earlier. Does a woman who's like a sex worker or mm -hmm. a stripper, do you think she deserves love and a good man? Mm. Of course. Everybody does. Because <laughs> everybody, <laughs> everybody, 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 everybody We're human beings, too. Yeah, we're human beings, too, who deserve love, too. Hey, let's start here. Who deserve love, too. Okay. Answer it. Just because... He got My you. answer. And he got you. I already knew he was going to say this. Um, <clears throat> Keep it a bean. Do she deserve a nice, loving relationship? A, a good man a yeah. good man maybe he don't care about that oh maybe he don't care <laughs> crazy, maybe he crazy. Don't care interesting about what about you i think every person deserves love, love. they get all fucking communal uh, and <laughs> i'm wrong for that i know why are you guys being such haters yeah. like i don't know y'all just how are we hating let's, let's answer the we question we don't deserve love that's why you 
Why? Well, so, you just said a second ago, a player doesn't uh, deserve a good woman, let right? You did. Have love, hold on, hold on. Or did loyalty. You, did you say a second ago that a player no, doesn't no, deserve a good? Qu- his question was, if they're community dick, does he deserve a loyal woman? Yeah, and you said no. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh my so, God. so but, but like, by your logic, then, because a community guy doesn't deserve a good woman, then a community woman doesn't deserve a good man, right? By your own logic. But didn't you say that men and women are the same, so why should that be equal? Yeah, good point. And I'm going to answer that here in a second. You, 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 think, you think you got something there. No, 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 no. I'm going to explain here in a second why. The math is not mathing. No, the math does math here in a second. I'm going to explain. But but you, by your own standard, you're saying that it's... It's different, though. Oh, now it's different. I think was like a loving relationship is like what he was asking no, I asked what I asked. Loyalty, like, you said loyalty. Loving. Swing it, dick. <laughs> Can we all finish giving Swing our like that. own opinions? Yeah. Can, uh, you know. What about you? You didn't get to give yours. I, I think everyone deserves love, but I'll say you get what you give. See, she did it in a yeah, yeah. very yeah. yeah. And and, and, and it's very interesting to see the women's uh, answers on this one because we have two girls on the panel that are involved in sex work, so they're gonna give <laughs> yeah pussy answers. What, what about you? Oh, you think God. yes? Yeah. Okay. Know, Contradicts your logic, but okay. Everybody deserves love, right? That's question? Everyone deserves love. No, no, no. Does, Does he deserve a, a sex worker, female deserve sex worker? Deserve a good man who's going to love her, protect all that shit. Yeah. Does she deserve that? Yes. Okay. Yes, because she's human. Uh-huh. Exactly. So community dick doesn't deserve love, though? No, or I didn't, deserve no, I didn't say that. I said he oh, you said, I, oh, he yeah, does. I said okay. he should. Mm-hmm. What about you? Yes. But community penis can't get... I mean, well, it's, it's two different things. That's the same like, thing. If, if, if the woman, work, no, no, because the woman is Bro, working, said, that's yeah. your job. You know, if you're a community dick, then you're just fucking around because you want to fuck around having a loyal a woman. Okay, I have you a know. question for you on that one. Um, do you think it's easy for men to get sex? Um, to certain. Well, we were on the panel. Most of the women here said they reject most men that talk to them, correct? Mm-hmm. Correct. It's going to be somebody so, that gave it to them. That's why I you really think so. Just yeah, not on this table. Somebody. But you really think so? Yeah, it's somebody, somebody, somebody who's gonna bust it open. What, what if I told you it's that ideas. that women are pretty similar what they look for in guys? And if a guy struggles with one girl, there's probably a good chance that he might struggle with five. It's then he might struggle with ten. Might struggle with a bunch. Somebody that give it to him. Mm. Mm. It uh, might not be the girl he want, but somebody. That's a very that's a very female way of thinking. Tell that to all the niggas that watch corn and do only I watch OnlyFans. Somebody that corn doesn't mean he struggles. So anyway, any any guy any man that's in a relationship or got women that's satisfying him pretty much ain't watching porn like that yeah mm-hmm. somebody true. gonna give it to him yeah no i don't okay. know if that's uh, true um so you him. so you said no because he's giving out community dick but do you think it's easy for men to give out community dick as you're saying it's different what what was the question do you think it's easy for men to get sex from women uh to certain like i said you said what it's what to certain certain, certain men. men yes do you think most men it's easy or hard no, I wouldn't say most. Oh. You think for most men it's not easy or you're saying most men it's it's hard? I mean, or it's, it's easier it's, hard it's, for most men. Yeah, for for most men. It's It's easier it's hard certain, for most men. Certain men, certain men get it easy, certain men don't. Okay, would I you just say think, I just think that there is a lot of generalization going on here that yeah, I don't yeah. I don't usually do. Mm-hmm. I don't stand with generalization, so that's yeah. why I maintain But the it world works certain. in generalizations. Yeah, sure. I don't. I don't that's your how the world, world works. Your no, world. no, no, no. That's no planet. Your perception hold on, hold on, hold on. of the world is a reflection of planet, what's within. Planet Earth. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> See, this is the difference planet between... Earth. What? Look, look, look. You're good, you're good. The world <laughs> operates on generalities, okay? For example, when you go to the bathroom, even though they're trying to be crazy about it, there's typically a men's bathroom and a women's bathroom, right? Because in general, well, there's two genders, right? Despite clown world or whatever mm-hmm. they're trying to say, there's two genders, right? Um... In general, most people have two legs and walk, right? So we have stairs for people to be there. There's handicap every now and then, but that's not the general, so we don't have handicap railings, everything. So the world operates on generalities, right? There's in Braille everywhere because most people can see, correct? So I get that you're like, this is offensive because this is a general conversation, but the world works on generalities. That's how it goes. Most people are right-handed, right? So therefore, when they make guns, they make most guns right-handed because most people are right-handed, so that's in general. (laughs) But if you're okay. left-handed, you get a scholarship. Stupid. <laughs> All right. Uh, you got to limit the low IQ com- uh, comments. <laughs> Look it up. So, uh, so anyway, back to what I was saying as far as... Uh, so do you think a majority of men struggle to get sex or not? Yes. Okay. So th- by definition, that means it's difficult for most men to get sex. So is it really hard to give out community dick? Because you're trying to equate the two. 
like that giving out community dick is the same as being a female and being a sex worker which one is harder a guy that's good with women and has a bunch of girls and able to give what i wanted to say is that like if a man per se if a man is a sex worker it's it's like saying that like the man doesn't deserve love you know the men also deserves love but if you're if you're a community dick or a community pussy then you're not well, he didn't say the man's a sex worker. He just said he's out here smashing girls. That's what I'm saying. Like it's it's two different things that you're comparing. But what what, ma what makes them different? She's saying one's getting that paid. That when you have others. a loyal, one is like a profession. That's, that's, that's getting the paid. That's what one she's is saying. it? That's her argument. Correct. Okay. Is it? Uh, let me ask you a better question. Is it easier for a woman to be a sex worker or for a man to get sex? I would say for a woman to be a sex worker. So wouldn't it be fair to say that when things are easier, they're not respected? Mm -hmm. Correct. Okay, so by that logic, that is why a guy that can go out and have sex with a bunch of women is not the same as a female sex worker. By your own logic, you just admitted it. Okay. I think that's an opinion, but... <laughs> what, what, what about it, you? It, when, hold on, hold on, wait. No, it's an absolute fact. Is it easier for a girl to be a sex Source. worker or for a man to have sex with girls? Absolute fact. It's easier for a, a girl to be a sex worker. So therefore, it is not respected. What, what, I mean, uh, look, we just got to have the comfortable conversation, uh, uncomfortable conversation. Why have prostitutes and sex workers and porn stars, etc., been in minus since the beginning of time? Because female promiscuity has never been respected because it's easy. Whereas men that have a bunch of women are respected. Look at guys like Dan Bozarian, the Tate Brothers, etc. Guys that have a bunch of women, right? Um, uh, Hugh Hefner, etc. They got a bunch of girls. That's not e hard to do. Sorry, that's not easy to do. So it's respected. But no one gives a fuck about the bitches that are there. They care about the guy because he's able to get the girls. And clubs and everything. Back in the old days, kings had many women and wives. So it's just had, like normal. They had the resources. Like I, now the guys who are able to access a lot of women are the ones who have the resources. And how? Yeah. And is it easy and to get resources? No. No, it's very hard. It that, is why, that is why men that can get a bunch of women are respected and women that are sex workers are not. It's very simple. Perfect. I know you ladies don't like to hear that because it's female empowerment and yeah, we're special and we deserve the world. No, you fucking don't. If you get into certain professions, you don't deserve the world. You put yourself in a box. Congratulations. That's where it is. Mm, it's. I don't. I don't think that it's not really that they don't deserve the world. No, you don't deserve to damage a guy. Like you, you get a good guy, you don't. He don't deserve that. So because she's a person. sex worker, that means huh? she's gonna damage the guy that she dates. So hold on, yeah. you're gay, right? What I'm you, what? Your guy? No, your guy. I said uh, your man. Oh, your man. You want him to <laughs> date? <laughs> 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 you're a guy. <laughs> you love him, right? Mm -hmm. You love your guy, right? Mm -hmm. Would you want him to date a sex worker? Would you want to date a sex worker? Oh, would I want to date a sex worker? Him, him. Would you want him to date a sex worker? Yeah. Be honest. Like, come on, man. Be honest. He's dating me. No. He's but, 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 but why, though? Why? Because he's dating me. No, no, okay, it wasn't dating you. Oh, okay. And you, and you still love and care for him. Let's say mm -hmm. maybe it was like, maybe your son. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Would he, should he date a sex worker? Mm. Be honest. If that was like my son, friend, whatever, I mean, I wouldn't want him to because, like we say, the the profession but is why? not respected. Because the profession is not re Let's call it what it is. The profession is not respected. Oh, I, oh. No, I've been said that. I've been said that from the get-go. Yeah. The profession is not respected. But my point mm -hmm. is that no matter the profession, as a human, as a person, if this girl want to say that she want to go find a man that love her and whatever she want, she does deserve that. And yeah. if a nigga... I don't know if I say that, but if a man <laughs> want that and he does that, <laughs> he could do the same. It's just Period. they're people and everybody but, but deserves think, love. Do you think that people who are not doing good things deserve the right to damage people? But see, good things is an opinion. That's the kind of opinion yeah, like, thing. Generally, like, speaking, listen, generally speaking, how do listen, sex generally speaking, listen, 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 listen. Gener generally speaking, generally dealers. speaking, men are not okay with their women showing their bodies, what? having sex. Yes. It makes them feel bad. Mm -hmm. So what I'm saying is, it does emotional damage to men, mm -hmm. whether you like it or not. Yep. You, you're a woman. Yeah. <laughs> people having access to your woman does extreme emotional damage to men so what I'm asking is mm -hmm. do you so feel so there's a lot of things though honestly right. mm -hmm. we could, we could say, finish real quick if, 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 if with that being said do you mm -hmm. think a person deserves the right to damage another person no. But th that's the thing, though, because to you that's damaging. But come to on, most yeah. men, like, to oh, most men, is good. There's a lot of this conversation. We all know that there's guys who are yeah, yeah, don't marry. Generally them. speaking, and what happens to them? Generally speaking, generally, and um, even what, the guys they, who they don't mind, they do mind. They Divorce. just they just give in everything. No, unless unless a dude making money off you, unless he's the no, I know. Well, you so got listen, a lot listen. of nerve to talk about the way you view someone else being damaging to them. It is real. emotionally damaging to a man. But that's for to you. Other I know, no, but like, don't you think like the way that like 
um, we're having conversation at this table and you're like putting certain sh- things on them is emotionally damaging. Like, no offense, right? It's your show. You're talking about your opinion, but like how you are, don't you think that could be emotionally damaging? To, like, put somebody that's else. Wait, did you say a second ago? I I want to hear what I need to hear. Did you say that earlier? <laughs> the fuck I think about, about? seventeen about, minutes ago. This you said isn't like personal to me. No, no, no. Right? No, like, you said a sec- You literally sake. said. No, you yeah, said. No, it. I right. hear what I need to hear. Yeah, I'm I telling know. you it, the truth. It's not personal to me at all. It is emotionally damaging to a man. Most men. Mm-hmm. Most men. Right. Most I know, men. but like the emotionally damaging. Conversation? Emotionally damaging to a man for his woman t- for people to have access to his even woman. Now e- even the guys even the guys who accept it, they mm-hmm. just give in. And the only guys who don't who do accept it, they either the pimping or they don't care about you. Yep. Mm. Mm. He said so it. So what I'm asking Sorry. again is: It does a woman who will emotionally damage her man? Does she have? Does she deserve the right to do that? Do you think that's intentional? Who gives a fuck about <laughs> intentions? We talking about what happens, I don't like know. the I'm outcome. Just curious. Yes, it's, it's intentional. If you have a if you have a man and you give your body to somebody else, you you didn't slip and up and just like okay, oh so shit. They, just, okay, so you so think so that people just make it do matter? that with intentions? Hold up, hurt them? hold up. Just make it matter to the man. Who, who who don't want that and then the man who do want it, you get what i'm trying to say like if the man want it you want it and if you don't just don't go for that type of girl just go for what you want don't go no fist you don't go for her if she's not what you oh, want i'm don't all go for that her. don't no i'm you, you, you must don't know i'm all for that but i'm just i just want to know because we have this thing to where it's like men are somehow zombies like we don't feel shit. We don't go through emotional pain. We don't that. we don't get damaged by shit. And it's just like, like, oh, well, you got to accept it. I want to show my titties. No, I want to go fuck. No, 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 no. Men, I feel like men kind of put that kind of stereotype on themselves. But I just men, asked y'all, listen, men, listen, I just I asked y'all, I just asked y'all, does a woman who's doing sex work deserve a man who's gonna treat her right all y'all said yes no they I, don't i said no i, I haven't well, answered well, yet by the answer. way i haven't answered i say no because if they're doing that at the moment they are giving men access to see their bodies or selling their bodies so mm-hmm. you shouldn't be dating anyone that's my opinion you should like if you want to try to date after that like do that but i think it's equal it goes both ways question for you if they stop while you're dating, dating them right is the internet forever yeah, it's there forever, so you have to know so, that your kids are going to see it, so, I mean... So, regardless, it's still going to be there. It's still going to be there, but uh, I'm just saying, like, uh, for sure at that moment when you're doing it and you're making money off of it, like, no, like, I don't think any guy would be okay with that. I wouldn't. You were going to say something? I don't really think it's, like, anyone else's place to um, tell someone how they find their happiness or not. Okay. You know? So, Especially the past doesn't if matter. It, if it doesn't affect them, no the past doesn't matter no i'm saying like another person living their life i shouldn't get to tell them wh- why they get to be happy or not if mm-hmm. it's not affecting someone else if you it's know not affecting like me. i don't think that that it's another person who is like viewing shit from the mm-hmm. sidelines mm-hmm. to sell someone that they don't deserve happiness mm-hmm. so are you saying that like okay what you did in the past doesn't matter you deserve happiness regardless no i'm saying Mm-mm. that if i happiness see someone maybe not doing something that i understand that or that with. i agree with that i get to tell them that they don't deserve happiness mm-hmm. i'm saying like i don't think so you, that like, I sh- you, have, I you have to that, earn happiness i don't think that anyone here can answer the question as to like how another sh- person should like get to be happy in their life like, it's interesting how when we asked if community dick deserves a loyal girl you, a lot of you that. a lot of you were very quick to say no he does not deserve a loyal woman but when but we flipped the script and said yo does a girl that's involved with sex work deserve a l- dutiful loyal man you guys were like yes so I find it interesting how for women they don't feel like they yeah, need to earn their the man. That's question, not though. what I'm telling you right now. That's not anything. I didn't say that. So let's say you're you friend. gave a troll answer. Yeah, before you're, you're, you're trolling. What I say? Please tell me. You don't me. even remember what you said. <laughs> we don't know. Sure. Yo, but let's say your friend right was about to enter a bad relationship with somebody. Mm-hmm. Would you lie to them or tell them the truth? Um. Hey, this person's bad for you. Just, just so you know. Yeah, I don't even think that I would fully be able to like know or not because I'm not. But you know they have a bypass. As a friend, I would tell them my that you're a great piss. But it's not. Um, I don't know. From the past, I would do the best I can, but I don't think it's my responsibility to like decide. That's your friend. That's your friend, man. Yeah, that's your friend. So what? Like, it's not my responsibility to figure out someone else's life for them. That's crazy. Let me ask you a question. Then hold on, hold on. How about this? How about this? Um. Let's say you were with a guy for like two, three years and you liked them and you know, you like, damn, this might go somewhere. 
Uh, but you find out that uh, he did gay porn before, and he sucks some dick. <laughs> uh, would you stay with him? Yeah. Hold on, I'm asking her. I don't know. Oh. Honestly, like, no. this is something that, like, depends how I feel. Do we have chemistry? Yeah, like, you got some chemistry. It's a, it's a possibility. You, you think it's a possibility? <laughs> yeah, this is a hypothetical situation. I never lived through it, so I can't tell you for sure. All right, but it make you question some things, right? Of course. But doesn't he deserve happiness with you? <laughs> um, he deserves happiness in his life. Yeah, but it might not be but, with but, me. But, but hold on, hold on. No, 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 no. But but that's the key to the happiness is being with you. Yeah, with you. No one should ever um rely on someone else for their oh. key to happiness. So you're you telling me that. his actions directly affected his ability to get happy. No, Ooh. I'm saying no mm. one should ever rely on someone else to feel happy. No, but you see see my point that I'm trying to make here is that mm. actions have consequences they and do. sometimes you Absolutely. relinquish your ability to pursue happiness from mm -hmm. bad decisions. Mm -hmm. His happiness was with you, but now it's being a question because yep. he made a bad decision. Your mm -hmm. happiness being with someone else is already This why where this it's why a women problem. be making bad decisions. This why half crazy okay. No, listen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you think that a happiness lot of women should stop, rely on stop. someone else? I could tell we could talk about men too, but a lot of women and this I'm saying this because you're a woman and I'm just speaking, right? A lot of women they on fucking psych meds, half crazy nowadays. It's because they make bad decisions. Happiness, you have to earn happiness. You the happiness is a luxury. You don't just get to wake up, do bad shit, fuck whoever you want to fuck, bruh, take drugs, and then happy, think it, it don't work like that. Why not? It don't work like that. Why, why do you have reality? to earn you it's don't it's have it's to you have to dictate other people's earn happiness? happiness. Huh? You don't I don't, don't, I just want to leave. The problem is, is when you make bad choices, sometimes it can really affect you. Who cares? You don't get to dictate other people's happiness. Happiness. Focus on your own happiness. Yo, uh, like, who cares if someone else is yo, happy if, or not? If, if you're going, you could dip right now. So, yo, your IG is off the description. So, she got triggered. So, uh, the cam? Well, it is what it is. Yeah, she um, got triggered, man. But, but yeah, yeah, you, you don't get to like you don't just get to wake up and just be happy. You have to earn your happiness. Mm -hmm. If that was the case, we'll all stay in bed all day, eat sugar. But what yeah. if somebody did? What? Like what if you knew somebody who just woke up yeah. and I don't they were know happy? nobody like that. I do. Okay. I don't get it either. I don't like, know why she's like that. Happiness is just like a choice. Like you're right. You do have to earn your own happiness. You have to work for that. You have to wake up every day and be like, I'm gonna be happy today or I'm gonna do whatever, you know brings me this joy you have to choose that because if you just wake up just in a nasty mood how you gonna get out of that you I'd need to tell yourself that more yeah. people in the world wake up and be happy and not bother me than people wake up and be mad and i have to fucking talk to them or bump into them in the street and it's a problem for me i don't understand it either but i do know some people who that's how they view their life and i admire that you know like i don't want to tell anyone what why they do or don't get to be happy all i want to worry about is like you know how to be the best happy i can <laughs> everyone has a right to to live their own life and yeah. if, if you choose to do that route that is your choice you you are in a country where you have the blessing that you can do that make your money do your thing it's just saying be mindful that there might be consequences of most men are not going to like that of and if course. you can say that and say okay that's going to impact my selection of, of who a future mate is and maybe you don't want a future mate and that's perfectly fine too it's just saying be mindful of the fact that there are things out there the things that are hard in life are the things that are respected of course and um you know like some people who you might want to tell to be mindful you're assuming that they're not like I think most a lot people of, aren't i would I, think I would argue a lot of young especially young people because of tiktok and all these different I social medias a, it's easy uh, to make money and they don't think about the future i think a lot of people who are in the industry that you're trying to remind them of the consequences are very aware of that and that's something they deal with every day and yeah well and, and that's the thing is it's 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 it comes with the territory i have friends that do these things and that's that's their choice they and they recognize that but it's also on, just you're, you're, see here's the thing you're aware of the consequences but you're not going to experience the full brunt of the consequences until so you get later. older yes. yeah mm -hmm. see when it's but all good and, it's it all matter? it's all good and dandy when you're in your 20s and it's like oh this is awesome like i'm traveling and guys want me and this is awesome like look your friend can't even handle the truth she's walking out right now because oh, shit, i better get her yeah well yeah oh. i don't know she i think uh yeah I think, she's, I think she's butthurt about the truth but the reality is if it wasn't <laughs> if it wasn't so painful and so taboo she would not be wanting to leave but she's very uncomfortable in the conversation because we're telling the truth yo you get in a certain profession you're going to inhibit your ability to find a man that's going to take you seriously that's of some real consequence and attraction mm -hmm. the only guys that are going to go for you are going to be simps we can lie to you but the truth is that's, it's a fact that's that's what it is so yeah. like source a source for what life in particular 
Source for what? Trolling. Yeah, I know you are. Okay. So, what happened, Chris? If, if it's going back on, she has to apologize. Oh, she, oh no, she's honestly, changed her bro, mind? I can be. I'm sorry. I Listen, I have to I'm going to do some ask a question. Sure it's, it's what it is. is she, what's is the deal, Chris? Yeah, like, she might be honestly, okay. I need to not run my mouth. Anymore. There's some like chaos going on in the back. <laughs> she 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 got emotional. She left. I asked her she was leaving. Yeah, that no was like that tough. Yeah, that wasn't that even that tough, bro. <laughs> Damn. And it's better to leave too. <laughs> get him off, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. But, yo, I mean, that's just, that's just, fuck, show goes on. Talk, yeah, man. like, yo, like, ladies, well, just, just, just so y'all know, you can't shit, just, like, walk off the show, show and think it's going to be all good and shit like that. Like, like if your feelings are triggered or whatever, hey, it is what it is. But, I mean, if you're going to just, like, go off and shit, like, I don't know. Chris, what what are you, what are you saying? Hey, listen, she has to apologize, man. If she wants to come back on, she got to apologize? Yep. All right, yeah. If you want to come back on, you got you got to apologize for disrupting the show. Show goes on. Yeah. Huh? You gotta you gotta do it on on camera. Yeah yeah. You g yep. get back on the set. Come back. If, if you both y'all come, come back on and Take a deep apologize breath. for being fucking crybabies. Take a deep breath. <laughs> <laughs> like yo, we have real conversations on this podcast. Yeah, I mean, yeah, let yeah, me be, let me be show. very because here's the thing. Let me let me make this explicitly clear for y'all real quick because um. Women tend to be uh, not appreciative of certain things. Uh, this is a big-ass podcast, probably the biggest podcast you're going to be on. Like, y'all are fucking nobodies at the end of the day, and you're here as an opportunity, and it's a privilege for you to be here. It's not a right. It's not, you know, entitlement. I know you guys live life on easy mode, being on OnlyFans with Simpsons, shit like that. But you're on the Fresh Fit Podcast, so if you're going to come on our shit, you got to respect the rules. Now, I'm not really familiar with what went down a second ago, but Chris is saying if you apologize, you come back on, that's fine. But... You go ahead. I'll just turn it to you. And and then also, just once again, guys. Yeah. We can lie to you all day. Yeah, we can tell yeah, you the truth. We'll tell you the truth. Yeah. It, it is what it is. I mean, this ain't some sucker podcast. Yeah. We're gonna sit here and simp on you and tell you, oh, you're a sex worker. Great. Like, nah, man. Like that shit's a L. Yeah. So if you don't like the truth, it is what it is. You're free to walk off any time. But if you want to come back on, and Chris giving you the privilege, because I'll be honest with y'all. Yeah. Normally I'll be like, get the fuck out of here. We don't give a fuck what y'all say because we already got a platform. It's an opportunity for you to be here, right? Mm -hmm. So go ahead. You got something you want to say? I wanted to say that I'm sorry for getting up and leaving. I just got too sensitive, and I am a crybaby sometimes. But I'm going to put my feelings aside and continue. All right, cool. Okay. Just, just don't walk off. That's it. Yeah. Cool. And then, and then you? Oh, me? Yeah. I was just making sure she was okay. Yeah, I don't know about that. It seemed yeah, like you yeah. wanted to walk you, off, too. No, I was just checking on her. Oh, well, you got to apologize well. I do? Yeah. For what? For walking off. For walking off. I I I, don't, I wasn't like oh screw this podcast. I just seen my friend was in a little bit of distress, and I went and went to check on her. Bro, apologize or just get the, get kicked off the show. Because oh I'll be honest with you, like no, I'm I don't even. Whoa. If Chris didn't say yo, I'll give him a chance. I would have been like yo, y'all get the fuck out of here. You didn't see that, like I wasn't like this. Uh, this is enough for negotiation. It's wait, wait, an apology so or not. Okay, so wait, wait. Yes if I no? get kicked off the show, what happens? I told are you, you before the me, show. Are you gonna like rip Your me IG out will be my off. seat? I won't invite you. The niggas will DM you for like a month and then they'll Wait. forget about you, okay? Wait, so, tell me one more time. I'm sorry. Oh, what? No. Yo, you know what? You know How what? about this? Just get the fuck out of yeah, here, bro. Just, just, just get go, the fuck out of here, man. Seriously. Just get bro. out. What? Just get out of here, man, bro. You yeah. set your homegirl up like that. She well, was, was just... the bigger person, apologized, and yeah. you just. Sorry, I'm like. Man, you did your homie like that. Just get up and leave. That's crazy. Just get up and leave. Or what? Just yeah. get up and leave. Oh what? Oh wait, we have girls in the studio. Yeah, yeah like you know, just get up out. and leave. Like this ain't this ain't your crib. Just get out. Grace. <sighs> wow, bro. This is a Florida. This is your stand your ground state, man. You you trespassing now. Get out. So should I stand my ground or shouldn't stand my ground? No, you should, you no, should you, not. You, you should, should get not. Up, you get up now. This, ain't, this ain't California. This ain't California. Grace. Get up and leave. Grace, come on. Get up Grace. and leave. They're kicking you off, love. <laughs> right. You made her apologize and everything. I made her. I mean, you can yeah, just no, she good. You, you get up and leave. You supposed if to take I, one for the I team. What if I tell you I'm sorry? No, no, no you no. good. <laughs> we get out. Chance to do that get right out, there. man. Sorry. Get out. I wasn't going to get out. Okay. We're different over here, man. I can tell. Like I said before, like I, it, you lucky Chris is feeling Yo, nice today. We're not simple, bro. I would, I would have told both y'all to get off, but Chris was like, yeah. you know what? If you apologize, you come back on. So Even she's better. here, but you just get out. We ain't no damn sense, bro. Anyhow, she's never been told no in her life. You could tell. Sure, you know, ridiculous. Like Don't touch me, bro. I could hang just around no dude wow. who would take one for the team. Fucking like, ridiculous. If I would have did that, and my homie just, <laughs> the mate, man. <laughs> Fucking weirdos, <laughs> man. Crazy, bro. <laughs> Fucking weirdos. Uh, um, yeah. Anyway, welcome to Fresh and Fit, niggas. Welcome back. Clay, yo. What the hell? Trouble's on. Trouble's on. Fucking crazy-ass chicks, man. Bro. Anyway. 